What's up guys, welcome back to Simple Eats and today we're whipping together an awesome recipe. It's a butternut squash soup. Got this recipe from this company called Gill's Onion. They are the largest family owned growers here in the nation. Uh, we met through Twitter and they have tons of recipes. They sent me this awesome gluten free recipe that I'm going to share with you guys. And when you get a chance, check them out. They're all about sustainability, eating healthy and all that good stuff just like we're doing. So we're going to start with the butternut uh, squash here. I have two of these. I'm just going to cut the heads off and the booty off. Give it a nice flat surface. And what we're going to do is, we're basically just going to cut these in half. A little olive oil on these babies there. Definitely going to add a little bit of salt, bring out some of those flavors. Take your hands, massage these babies. Get it on the outside, get it on the skin there. Now you're going to set your oven for 350. It's going to be roughly about an hour. An hour. So we have an apple, green apple. We have two onions. Boom. This is where Gil's onions come into play. We have some carrots and celery. Our drumsticks, right? Boom, boom, boom. We're going to cut these into small pieces. And you can't forget your garlic. Awesome antioxidant. Right in our bowl, we have our veggies. All of our veggies that we're roasting. Of course, don't forget your salt. Don't forget your oil. Cover the top off. Let these babies sweat one hour or even less, depending on your oven, and it's a wrap. All right, guys, last but not least, our last butternut squash here. We just scoop these babies out. Add that right in. We're gonna blend this all together. We're gonna add in our nutmeg and cinnamon. We're gonna add the rest of these veggies in. This is smelling great already. Blend this together. Awesome. I'm gonna add half of my heavy cream here. Looking pretty good. I can add the rest. Awesome. We are done. We're gonna take this right to the stove for about five minutes. Let this all thicken up really nice. Alright guys, time to taste. Let's taste this baby. This is wonderful. Nice and warm in of course for the fall but it has a little sweetness from the apples and a little tartness too, which is really nice. Definitely complements the butternut squash. And I think I'm just gonna take this whole bowl and do what I do best, eat it. All right guys, peace out. Till next time, always remember, live healthy. What's up guys, welcome back to Simple Leads. I messed it. I came across this awesome company called Gill's Onion. They're, they, oh wow, hey. Crooks, this awesome company called Gills Onions, located out in California. We met, obviously, we met through Twitter. <laughs> I didn't want to say that. I messed up. Guys, where are you going? Hold up. I have to give you my information. All right. First, we're going to start out with where can you find me? Facebook, my Twitter account, my Instagram, of course, YouTube, and my website, simpleeats.tv. I'm going to write this up for you. We're going to start with our Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Tito Dudley, T-I-T-O-D-U-D-L-E-Y. Now my Twitter account, twitter.com forward slash official chef T, instagram.com forward slash official chef T. How does that look? Not too bad, right? And please, guys, subscribe to my YouTube channel so I can hear your comments. You can even inbox me. Of course, you can send me an email on Facebook too. At youtube.com forward slash simple eats TV, all one word. And last but not least, like my, my website. Like my website. Guys, please like my website. I would love if you like my website. Simple Eats, that sounded like Oprah. I'm sorry. That wasn't right. But simple eats.tv. Hey, and when you get a chance, support my cancer organization called First Ascent. You can like them on Facebook, follow them on Twitter, and check them out on their website at firstascents.org.